NBC spoilers for Monday, November 30. Tease that Charlie and Claire would strengthen the connection and possibly have a chat about their status. Charlie and Claire have covered this topic briefly, but they need to go a little deeper and make it clear that they are on the same page. NBC said Charlie and Claire will be discussing becoming official soon, so this romance will continue to progress. Although things were going well in Claire's love life, her family was turned upside down by Jan. Charlie argued that Claire shouldn't blame herself, but she would still feel guilty on Monday's dual episode. Marlena will come check on with Claire and give a reassurance to her niece. And it's true that Claire shouldn't believe it, but Marlena can credit Claire for having a spirit of forgiveness and a kind heart. Claire can't know how far Jan will go to make Sean her man, or John will strangle her. Duel is yet to confirm Jan is dead or comatose, but things are looking up for John. Jan was unarmed and did not immediately threaten John during that time. What John did was based on outbursts of rage and even revenge. So the defense argument wouldn't work. NBC said that Bell would get through John's legal dilemma on Monday and will implement some strategy. Bell probably thinks that John's well-doing could be used as a part of a def defense measure. After all, John was no longer himself since he had that cerebral aneurysm and it disturbed John's emotions and causes him to have extreme reactions. Jay also tortured John's family members for many years, so it would be easy to explain why John is so upset, especially since Jan just announced Belle is dead. Belle is a legitimate eagle, so we have no doubt she can get John out of trouble sooner or later, and Belle will do whatever it takes to keep John out of jail. Meanwhile, Gabby will react to the shocking scene she just witnessed in the studio. Gwen cleverly put Gabby in there and hopes she will find exactly what she found. It is Jake in bed with Kate. Friday's stuntman was a shot of Gabby looking colorful, but she'd get a chance to release that anger on Monday. NBC said Gabby would come in and ask to know what was going on, and that would make Jake stunned and angry, so it wouldn't be long until a big fight broke out. Kate should get advice from Gabby, but she will probably take her clothes and take this as a sign to leave. Obviously, Gabe, Gabby and Jake will have a lot to catch up on. When Kate exits, Jake and Kate will continue their wits. Gabby might not be happy about how quickly Jake found a new way to keep his bed warm, but he wouldn't understand why she should care. Jake will remind Gabby that she doesn't care for him when she left. However, Gabby will call Jake an idiot and assert that all are just lies. She will explain that she pushed Jake away because of the danger to her family, and Gabby can't let Jake try to follow her or ask too many questions. Though Jake should be glad to finally have the real story, he won't bring Gabby back with open arms. Day spoilers point to a long journey for Jake and Gabby, so there would be a lot of drama to deal with before they are ready to move forward as a couple. Jake has had a real crush on Kate, so that seems the biggest obstacle.